references to Hitler. Hitler is like a big deal. Like he's like the, you know, the very, the very epitome of racism in America and in Europe. And uh, lots of references to him are censored out. Um, stealing your phone back, yeah. so it doesn't. So Chocobo doesn't pop out and start whistling. Um, I mean, I, I, eight, any eight-bit. Uh, you know, Fendos will know that uh, uh, Bionic, the game Bionic Commando was uh, originally about, uh, I forget the subtitle, it was basically the resurrection of Hitler, and the entire thing was involved Hitler being resurrected. Uh, people noted that the last boss looked a lot like Hitler, because it was Hitler. Um, so it's the same kind of thing in anime. Uh, in Mobile Suit Gundam, there was a reference to Hitler, and it that out. It's like, well, I mean, it, why? Why? You know, I mean, we teach our kids about Hitler in school. Why can't we just say it's not like a cuss word? The references to hell are also taken out as well on the religious note. Uh, I have it here that uh, in Dragon Ball Z, they call it um, HFIL, Home for Infinite Losers. That, that's great. Uh, Funny for the time. What's that? It was funny for the time. Yeah. Okay, speaking of Dragon Ball, um, since the original image on the right is kind of bad, uh, the image on the left is the sensor one. Smoking. He has a cigarette. That is something that you just don't do. Um, one piece. One piece. <laughs> with with, uh, with, <coughs> Sanji. with Sanji and lollipops, was it? Yes. Nice. Um, Sanji had a cigarette most of the time in the Japanese. Actually, in fact, it was probably about all the time. Yeah. Um, tobacco products are for both. Um, let's see. Uh, we had, um, I have it down here that uh, we had, uh, let's see. We had characters in Naruto that were smoking. But they had, they, the weird thing is, they had showed the pipe and they showed the cigarette, but they weren't lit, so... I mean, that was a big deal. Hell, even in Resident Evil, the original Resident Evil, they had a full motion video. He, I'm in a car. Or I'm in a panel, sorry. Um, in the original Resident Evil release, if anyone remembers it, the full motion video was cut because Chris Redfield was smoking. I mean, people are getting eviscerated by dogs and smoking where you draw the line. Uh, <laughs> Alcohol is also another big thing, uh, and the Toonami version of Tenchi Muyo, the sake references were substituted with tea. Uh, champagne and things in proper setting are usually allowed, but overall uh, it's taken out. Drinking on the street is obviously not, uh, it's verboten. Um, the, Some grabbing. Yeah. Uh, the, uh, it was, in Naruto, because it was, uh, it, it was, Aimed at a more mature audience, the uh, the bridge builder was shown drinking, but they took out the kanji on the bottle and they took the redness out of his face to make it less obvious that he was drunk. Um, but uh, the this this one actually is just something I picked up along my way. I've decided to randomly watch Sonic X. I had got the DVD for like a dollar, and if. Um, Anyone knows anything about Sonic X? It basically deals with the whole Sonic crew being transported to a human world. Uh, they had Knuckles on his own, and um, and he goes into this into this establishment. It's dark, it's dank, and it's a bar. But this is the American version. They're not going to show that. Uh, they literally photoshopped, and it was qu done quite poorly. Uh, a fast food restaurant image in the background and all the customers <coughs> had french fries and things on their on their tables and it was poorly done and all the drinks that were obviously alcoholic beverages were uh, it, was, it was soda and i think a table got turned over so you get to see these crappily photoshopped uh, french fries just kind of flip around on a flat plane because they weren't part of the original a part of the original plan. So, um, let's see. We have 
Now, violence, blood, gore, death, and weapons. Woohoo! All the good, the fun food groups. Um, image from Naruto. The interesting thing about this is that the one on the left is the censored version, but it's also released on Japanese DVD, so it's kind of a weird case. But yeah, violence is something in America that's. It's weird, though, uh, about violence, but no, you're not going to expose your kids to that. Anyone who remembers the He-Man cartoons, remember that He-Man never punched anyone directly. He always punched the screen, and then the, you'd see the results. Or he, he was, if he made physical contact, he was throwing people. Um, My son has the unbox, the, the box set of Naruto uncut. My son purchased the Naruto box set uh, uncut DVD. Right. And I was wondering, does that mean that if I watch that, it'll show the blood on there, or is, is it, or has uh, based, it been censored still? Based on the research I did, apparently the the one on the left is on the Japanese DVD release. Go figure. The bloodier one was not on TV. Yeah. The Japanese do weird things like that sometimes. But um, I I did notice some censorship on, even on the uncut version in the in the dialogue where the Darn. the American the American dub when um, when uh, the kid um, I'm, I'm sorry I don't know all the Naruto character names uh, uh, the kid with the with the solid bowl haircut and the doll oh, Rock, Lee. Rock Lee is fighting a guy out in the field and he has taken instead of his medicine he has taken a bottle of sake with I him. missed that I was gonna bring that okay yeah. yeah he instead they refer to it as a tonic yeah. In the American dub. And when you flip over to the Japanese subtitles, or the, you do the subtitles, right. they say sake. <laughs> because he does, he does a drunk. He gets fist. drunk. <laughs> and yeah, that was taken out because underage alcohol consumption. I mean, that is. But that's on the uncut, they call it uncut version. <laughs> well, like, the dub, I would never trust. I didn't yeah. watch that anyway. Um, maybe if you switch it to Japanese with subtitles, you can maybe see it. Maybe. Yeah. yeah. I kind of see it. Is that yeah? With uh, like, like I said, yeah. With you know, you see how what we came. I mean, things are cartoons are a little bit more violent now, but it's like you're still not going to see like blood or anything of that sort. Um, if you do, then it's very, very rare, and it's usually not as a direct. Re it's usually not like someone gets cut and then bleeds. It's like someone might get hit and then they might, you know. So that's like very, very rare. We're talking like when they, you know, things like Ren and Stimpy, where it's generally for. Um, the older set or her first kids, you don't see you don't see shows like that anymore. You get smudged about instead. Um, yeah, violence is usually done like you won't see the impact. You won't see it, or they'll slow it down. They'll make it as comical as possible because they think that kids are uh, will be desensitized to it, and then they're going to go on violent killing sprees. So I mean, you know, when you had Columbine and that, you know, that's a completely different other topic there. 